What's even more impressive than that is the video playback on this phone. It's incredible. I'm going to play you a 1080p video. Just check this out. So this is 1080p running at 30 frames per second. It looks fantastic. What's even more impressive about this is that we've been doing this all day, I've been doing this all day, and if you, if you feel the back of the phone, it's cool. The phone doesn't get hot, it does this very, very easily. Now what's even more impressive is that if I show you the timeline to this video, anyone who's ever played 1080p videos at home will know how difficult it is for a processor to do this. I'm going to jump to the back to the end of the video. I'm going to jump to the middle of the video. And we're going to see how long it takes for the processor to catch up. Okay? Here's the timeline. Go to the end of the video now. Oh, now. <laughs> okay. Oh. Oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, nor am I. Okay, so that's the beginning. There's the middle. There's the won't let me go to the end. But as you can see, if I jump around, it's immediate. What it allows you to, what, it, what it's doing here is the processing, the processor is so quick that there's no lag time. So you can jump to any part of the video and it doesn't hesitate, it doesn't lag and it doesn't stutter. Even more impressive than that, I think, is that we've been working with a company called Immersive Media. What they do is they produce videos that are 360 degree fully immersive HD videos. So what I'm gonna show you is Will I Am from the Black Eyed Peas. We followed him for a day. And this video is in 1080p. You might wanna hold on to this because this is pretty amazing. So, here we are. Will I Am is somewhere over here. There he is. I can zoom in on him. I can zoom out. I'm in full control. Now I can look up at the lights and I can even look at the audience. And if I want to check out their reaction, I'll zoom in. And they seem to be enjoying this. So this is a full 360 degree video at 1080p. Now I can even go all the way back now we're upside down. The frame rate never drops. In the same way that you can jump along the timeline in the other video, you can do it with this one. So I can go to the beginning and it doesn't hesitate. And again, if you feel the back of the phone, it's not very hot. Now when you're doing a demonstration like this, one of the last things, when you're demonstrating technology like this, it's very advanced. And the last things you really want to do, especially at CES when you've got the camera on you, is mess around with it. So you don't want to do any of this, because it might crash. You certainly don't want to do this, because what it will do is it will make it slow down, it will make it lag, it might start buffering. But as you can see, if I go back, it's running absolutely perfectly. And that's because this chip doesn't isn't working hard. What's even more amazing is that this device makes phone calls. You can send text messages from it and you can even access a calendar. Yeah, and it has an alarm clock. It does everything. So to finish off, this phone incorporates McAfee security. It has things like lock and wipe included. Uh, we have Lenovo devices. This was announced uh, a few days ago that are going to incorporate this chip. And just around the corner here, we have tablets that are using this chip that have some really cool demos. So thank you for uh, joining us. Have a great CES, and if you have any questions, feel free to ask.